All right, folks, back in the peanut butter and jelly studio, you know what's gonna happen. We're gonna try and make the greatest peanut butter and jelly sandwich ever. LaVon thinks he can do it. That's all I'm saying. I'm gonna try. LaVon, tell me your opinion on peanut butter and jelly, just real okay. quick. So real quick, I didn't grow up eating peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, but no, I love the flavor of peanut of peanuts, uh -huh. and I love the combo of peanut and sweet. What doesn't make sense to me is crunchy peanut butter. And I'll okay. tell you why. Tell me why. Because in the peanut butter sandwich, in my opinion, you gotta have soft, squishy bread. Agreed. And you can't spread crunchy peanut butter on soft, squishy bread. It'll, it'll fuck the bread it all just, up. It just fucks it up. So we're gonna try. We'll do something now. I got right. some ideas though. Like I love peanuts and, I, and then we're gonna figure it out. All right, here we go. What's that, 20 bucks? Well, I said the F words. $20 all right. every time. That's right. All right, here we go. Now, as you make the peanut butter and jelly sandwich for four minutes, the greatest peanut butter and jelly sandwich you can come up with with these ingredients. I'm gonna do a little quick fire questions with you while you make it. Are you ready, sir? I am ready. On your mark, get set, and spread the peanut butter. Here we go. And he's going straight Hawaiian. for Hawaiian okay, bread. Here for Hawaiian. All right, hit me up. Festival time. All right, here we go. You ready? Tequila or mezcal? Uh, tequila, all day. All right. Sriracha or Cholula? Sriracha. Who's got a microplane? Nobody has a microplane for right, peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, I'll sir. It out. <laughs> Bacon or sausage? Bacon. Levon is going for lime zest. Let's just be honest. Yep. Chicken oyster, real oyster, or Rocky Mountain oyster? Woo! A little nervous. Chicken oyster. No, Chick get chicken butt. Chicken butt. All right, fair. I'll take that. Prosciutto or country ham? Country ham. Spoken from a true southerner. Ribeye or filet? Ribeye, all day. There's not anybody that said filet yet. Ribeye, I guess all you get day. embarrassed if you're a chef and you say filet because that is embarrassing. Fondue or queso? Poncho's cheese dip from Memphis. Poncho's cheese dip from Memphis, and we get people raising their hands in the crowd. Pellegrino or Topo Chico? Topo Chico, all day, baby. Negroni or paper plain? Negronis. What's a paper plain? I have no idea. Nobody knows what the fuck a paper plain is. You got hot sauce? I know what it is. You make it out of paper. Hot sauce? Yeah. I don't have any hot sauce. No hot sauce in the house? No hot sauce in the house. Burger or dog? Burger. In and out burger. Cheese or no cheese? Three by three, animal style, no lettuce, no tomato. That's how you do it. Cuban or Reuben? Lighten up, Francis. They can get loud, I don't care. Reuben from cats. Reuben from cats. Otherwise, Cuban. Okay. That's one for the Cubans. Mesquite or hickory? Hickory. Hickory. Hickory, why? It's the real flavor of barbecue. Oh boy, here we go. Uh -oh. actually, <clears throat> actually, that's the only answer because you didn't say you didn't say oh. Texas or Tennessee? Tennessee. Asshole. <laughs> it's going down, son. I I like Tennessee. Who's got right. salt? I want salt. You're going to a wedding, 400 people, three courses. What do you think this meal looks like? Oh shit. Uh, I, I I don't know. I'm like. A, so, like, so when you get there, the dessert's gonna be on the table. What is it? Oh, dude. Preset like dessert. Strawberry shortcake. I'm into that. It's tough. Whipped cream's gonna have a hard time surviving, but it's good. I'm into it. I'm All right, into what's it. the entree? The entree is, uh, <laughs> shit, dude. I don't know. You think it's surf and turf? Or it's do you think it's probably chicken? Probably surf and turf. I want you to try this sandwich real quick. All right, let's describe it. So we've got smooth peanut butter with uh -huh. lime, lime juice, lime zest. Lime juice. Lime juice, lime zest, yeah. potato chips, and apricot jam. Okay. On, on King's Hawaiian bread. King's Hawaiian bread. I like the lime acidity. It's there. I like actually how the lime changes the apricot. The apricot, I think, is a little flat, but the lime zest. No, but it just makes you taste peanut butter. It elevates peanut butter. You know what else it does? It allows the peanut butter not to stick on your palate. Yes, sir. And the crunch? I love the fact that everybody adds crunch to their peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Ladies and gentlemen. You know what, though? It pairs really well with this love. Love and hope rosé. Really? I oh, like it's it. It's like Bird Bearing. Bird Bearing. <laughs> That's what I was going to put with it today. I love it. Yvonne Wallace, ladies and gentlemen. Sir? 
champion. Love you. Love you. Love you.